Hey everyone, I'm Jimbo Slice, and today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to use Voice Meter Banana for live streaming on Twitch. So the first thing you're going to want to do is install Voice Meter Banana, which is right here, and the VB Digital Auto Audio Cable, which is right here. And I will have the link to both of these in the description. So after you install these two things, you're going to need to set up a few things. What you would want to do first is go down to your audio device settings, right here, and make voice meter input your default device. But since you wouldn't be able to hear anything until you set up voice meter, we're going to save this step for later. So to start setting up voice meter, you're going to want to first put your speakers into your one of your hardware outs. So I would use a, the slot A1 and I would use the WDM version of whatever speakers you have. So right now I have my headphones plugged into the speaker output on my tower. So I'm going to use the so I use the WDM version of the speakers. Next, you're going to want to set your all your inputs, which should be your microphone and the VB virtual audio cable. So all you have to do is click on those, use the WDM version and the WDM version of the cable out virtual virtual audio cable. So once you have that set up, you should see that there are a few options everywhere. It could get a little confusing. All you're going to want to know is that these are these A1, A2, A3 are connected to all the outputs that you would hear and the b1 b2 is all virtual outputs that would be going into your stream or any any different thing that you would want to output it towards so right now for me i use my mic and i have my virtual audio cable set up to pull music from opera which is a, uh, a, a secondary browser i use opera only for stream elements which allows me to play music and allows uh people to request songs on my stream and I do this so that I can hear it at a different volume than my stream does, so I don't hear the same loudness, so if I'm in game or if I'm doing something else, I don't hear it at the same volume that my stream hears it. Well, let's get those audio devices set up so you'll be able to use a voice meter while listening to this to this video. So first thing you're going to want to do is identify which hardware out you have uh, selected to, to put into your headphones or whatever speaker system you use. And if you're using A1 like me, you're going to want to check this little A1. This I have named desktop because it's literally all the volume that comes that comes into my that could, would normally come into my headphones. That's where this goes because normally for you guys, it, this one would be set as the default device, the speakers. But sending it to here would send all that audio straight to the voice meter input, which is this little column. So that's why I have it set to A1, and you can set how loud or how quiet you want to hear the audio, and you could set it up to go to B1 or B2 which can then go into your Streamlabs OBS or whatever streaming software you are using. And the last thing you're gonna need to do is set up the audio for your stream. So basically you just come down here to AUX Audio Device 1, you click on the settings for it, you click on properties, and then you change the device to voice meter AUX output. So if you have fully set up your voice meter input, all you're gonna need to do is go over to your sound settings, Click on voice meter input and click set as default. Right now I already have it as default, but it'd be the same thing as me clicking on here and pressing set default. So once voice meter input is set as your default, you should now be able to hear everything I'm saying through voice meter banana. So if you want to be able to hear your music at a different volume level than your stream, then all you're going to want to do is set the same output for both, both the second and the third columns. And then... Whatever that output is, in our case, it is the VB virtual audio cable. You're going to want to go down into your, into your window settings, click on system and then sound settings, and then go to app volume and device preferences, and then scroll down to whatever, to whatever uh, uh, sound you're using. Right now, I'm going to be using Opera, so I have to start playing the, <clears throat> playing the sound so it recognizes it. So there it is. I will turn it off for the stream. So now you cannot hear it, and now you can. And right now, if I turn it up here, I can hear it very loud, which I should, probably shouldn't have done that. But yes, so you can hear it at a different volume. Okay, I probably shouldn't have turned your guys up. But yes, you can see that if I turn the volume up, you can hear it louder, and I couldn't hear it at all. So I can mute both of those, so that you won't be able to hear it, and I won't be able to hear it, but it's still, playing, it's still trying to play the music through. So what you're going to want to do is scroll down here to whatever if you're using spotify it will come up if you're using any other any other browser it will come up all you're going to want to do is it should be on speakers automatically set that to cable input 
after you have after you've set it to cable input you're gonna want to go here and click on whichever one you want to be your stream playing music you want you're gonna want to click on whichever virtual thing your whichever virtual audio output you're using which could be b1 or b2 i'm using b2 so i might have mine set to b2 and whichever one you want to hear your, the music through through your headphones you're going to want to click a1 a2 or a3 whichever hardware output you have set that set it to and for your microphone you can adjust any of the settings here but i keep mine on on just zero decibels just the normal input that's coming into it and I have mine set to go out to B2 which is this little map master section tab right here so for my stream I also have mine at negative 7.1 you might be wondering why because I, I think that the Fortnite volume and whatever game I'm playing is usually too loud so for the stream at least so I turn it down a little bit and then I turn it back up when it's going out into my into my headphones i turn it i have it on positive 12 decibels going into my headphones so i can hear it louder but the stream doesn't have to so this was just a quick tutorial on how to set up voice meter banana for live streaming hope you guys enjoyed and you should come check out my live stream at 5 30 almost every day make sure to leave any comments about how to do anything in the video or if you are confused at any point see you guys later peace